Hey guys, it's Shani and I'm back today with another plan with me. And for this week's spread, I'm using this kit from Sadie Stickers. I think this kit was called Cherry Blossom or something. It had this really pretty like cherry blossom theme throughout it, obviously. Um, and it was a photo kit and I really do love her photo kits. Um, the only thing that I don't like about photo kits in general, not about hers in specific, is that I always feel like I'm missing deco. Um, and so, yeah, I don't know. I just, I love them. I love the look of them. I love using them, but sometimes I'm like, oh, I need some deco in my like spreads and I just need something different than like foiled icons, doodle icons, foil icons, you know what I mean? And I also feel like it's really fun to layer with floral deco, um, floral deco. So that is something that, um, I miss in photo kits, but like I said, I do still love using them. So uh, this week for my sidebar, I used the ninth full box that came with the kit. And then I used two headers to kind of sandwich the habit tracker that I used in the sidebar. Um, and in it, I just marked that I was trying to read every day. Uh, this was my first full week off. Like it, the week before was the week of my finals. And so this was my first full week off of school. And it was so fun and so exciting to finally not have to study. <laughs> um, so now I'm just putting down the headers. I used the patterned headers that came in the kit. And the date dots that I used for this spread, as always, are the bow date dots from my shop. In case you're wondering, this was also the first full week, or sorry, the first week of May, not the first full week, last week of April, first week of May, and it was also the week of my dad's birthday, so we kind of celebrated that on the weekend, as you'll see. But anyways, Monday at the bottom here, I'm just starting by using this scalloped circle from Panda Bird Designs as well as a um, like, you know, takeout icon or like fast food icon from Crafts by Towie. And I also used a swoosh from my shop. That was to mark down that I just got some Wendy's with one of my girlfriends. Um, this day I also did have to get an oil change and my dad came with me. So while we were waiting for that, we got some coffee from McDonald's. I actually really love their coffee. Um, it's delicious. So uh, we got that and kind of took a little walk around um, like where the car dealership is. So I marked it with a latte bow icon and I layered that on top of a circle like layering sticker from the kit. Uh, to mark the oil change, I used a quarter box from the kit as well as a car bow icon from my shop. I kind of just put it where it would cover up the bow that's in the center of the quarter box. Um, I always think bows like in centers like that, like half boxes or quarter boxes or wherever, I always think they look super cute, but they always interfere with the icons that I use. So I end up like covering them up or just like avoid them. Um, sometimes I just leave them because like I said, I do think they look cute, but it's just something else that I have to like work around. So um, I prefer when boxes don't have those. And then at the top of the day, I used a package icon to mark that I had an H&M order come in. Then moving on to Tuesday, I marked painting my nails. I layered two of these mini arrows from the kit, as well as a nail polish doodle icon from my shop and a tiny bow overlay um, that's also from my shop to kind of, you know, foil up that little doodle. And then underneath it, I marked doing some reading. I was reading on Honeymooners, which was a really fun, light read. Um, <laughs> I It kept drawing me in, which is always great. So I was reading that and I marked it with a quarter box as well as a book bow icon. Underneath it, I'm using this kind of like swirly um, like little divider. And that's from a Jax and Pepper freebie that I got. It is in one of my upcoming hauls, but I'm not sure when that'll go up. It'll all depend on <laughs> how much I end up buying and, you know, how fast it all comes in, I guess. Um, and then here I'm using a third box with a scallop little corner from the kit and a boba bow icon from my shop to mark that my friends and I decided to get some bubble tea as well as Korean corn dogs, which we're obsessed with. They are so delicious. And so we decided to get that. I think we also got some Tim Hortons afterwards, but I didn't have room to mark it. So kind of just marked those two. But yes, I was like sitting in the back seat with like a million drinks. I had a water, I had my bubble tea, I had my iced coffee, and I was like, this is excessive. 
Um, anyways, Wednesday at the top of the day, I'm using this appointment label to mark that I was packing and mailing some returns from all of my online shopping adventures, which I love. I'm sure there was a Zara return in there somewhere. <laughs> And then I had a plan with me go live. So I used this bow sticker from Paper Blush Bar. Uh, then my mom and I visited my grandma. And so I just used these kind of like twinkle stickers that were also on that Jackson Pepper freebie. Um, uh, I, I couldn't really think of anything to use. I like, I don't know, I guess I could have used some like hearts or like a house icon, but just decided to use some of these twinkles. And then uh, I went to one of my friend's houses for dinner. She made some really good dinner and I wasn't even going over for dinner. I just went to go visit and it just so happened that she was making dinner and obviously I had to stay <laughs> and it was delicious. So I marked it with a half box and some like leaf floral deco uh, from my shop as so is that like meal icon, like the cutlery there. Then Thursday morning, I got a massage, which was so lovely. So I marked it with a third box as well as these like slippers uh, that are from my shop. So are these books here that I'm just using to mark uh, reading the book that I was reading, like I said. And I also layered that on top of a corner scalloped that's also from the kit. And then this day we went to another friend's house. We just had a little wine night, which was really fun. And I actually really like how this all turned out. Um, I layered an arrow from the kit with some more of like the leaf floral deco from my shop. And then I also used a wine glass bow icon to mark that. And I just, I really love that like leaf. I feel like whenever I, I pull it in, it always ends up looking super cute and brings in some more foil, which is always great. Who doesn't love more foil? I mean, honestly, actually, sometimes you can't go for foil overload. So I shouldn't say that, but <laughs> I do like how this section turned out. Uh, Friday, I'm marking another plan with me going live with another one of the paper blush bar bow icons. I also had an order from White Deer Stationery come in. I feel like White Deer Stationery and Zara are like the two or like packages that come in just you know, one of them is like my clothing, one of them is like my stickers, and they're just, they're always rolling in. <laughs> I used a envelope doodle icon from my shop to mark that layered on top of a label from the kit. And then this day, my cousin and I got some bagels and Starbucks. Um, we always want to like go get Starbucks. And then there's like this really delicious like bagel shop, bagel bakery. I don't really know what it's called. <laughs> it's called What a Bagel though. Um, and we always end up going and getting bagels. So I marked it with a um, coffee, like iced coffee doodle from my shop. And I layered it on top of a circle layering sticker from the kit. And then I'm just marking hanging out with another friend in the evening um, with a quarter box as well as a car bow icon. Then Saturday was my dad's birthday and we were just having like a little outside on the patio like birthday dinner for him. So I marked uh, cleaning in the morning with an appointment label that you'll see me put down in a second here. And then I used another one of the Jackson Pepper dividers. This one kind of had like dashes going through it, which I thought was kind of cute and doodly. Um, interestingly enough, I'm not sure if these are meant for your weeklies because they're actually cut out to be like more than 1.5 inches. I feel like the divider itself is 1.5 and then the outline is more. So I'm not sure if that was just like a mistake or it's meant for your monthlies or maybe it is on purpose. I'm not too sure, but just something to know. And then for prepping the dinner, I used this cooking sticker from my shop and layered it on top of another like circle layering sticker. And then for the dinner, I used a panda bird design scallop circle to kind of match the one that was on the other side of the spread. And then the balloon bow icons as well. Then Sunday, I marked doing some yoga and stretching with a yoga mat icon. And then um, my friends and I got some like booster juice and also had lunch at teriyaki. Or did I say that right? Why did it come out sounding teriyaki? Teriyaki? I don't know. Um, but I used a half box with some more foiled floral deco from my shop for that. I was going to use some more like cutlery, but I already used some like, I don't know, like kind of close to it on Wednesday. So I wanted to just change it up. And then to mark hanging out with my friend again, 
used another one of the car icons and I layered this one on top of a hexagon that was like one of the layering stickers from the kit. I feel like I used a lot of the layering stickers, but I just, I kind of love playing around with them and see these stickers it has some really cute ones and a lot of variety in her kits. So I do like using them, but that was pretty much it. I went ahead and popped my inserts back into my planner, threw one of them accidentally across the table, but you know, all went nicely back in. And I just, I love how this spread turned out. There's so much rose gold foil, which I adore. And I just, I really, really like how it turned out. So I hope you guys like this plan with me. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thank you.